Um, how many of y'all have heard of a thing called the Bible? It's a pretty important thing. What we claim and what people who've gone before us for thousands of years have realized is that God speaks to us through the Bible. And we believe that God inspired the words of the Bible so that they're not just words um, like many books, but God has a particular plan and design for us and for the world that we see most clearly through the scriptures. Over here are Bibles to be given to our sixth graders, and over here are Bibles to be given to our third graders. We give it third grade Bibles because third graders are starting to read more and more. And we want you, third graders, to be encouraged to read your Bible. So we're going to give you a Bible, and then we'll have a test on it. In a No, no, I'm sorry. That's for the sixth graders. So the sixth graders um, have learned to read, but they're coming into a whole new um, place of maturity. And so we want you to have a Bible that's more your own and more your age. And so this is the teen study Bible here. I forget what's the name of the adventure Bible um, for, for third grade. So who's, who's a third grader here? Cadence. Shelby. And when, when, and then sixth graders. Mason. Mason. Kelsey. Kelsey. And Teresa. And Teresa. Okay. So these Bibles are ones that I hope you have all your life. I want to encourage you to write in them. It's okay to write in them. And even though some people might say don't, I even dog ear pages. Do you know what dog ear pages is? Where you fold the edge down so you remember where you were. It's okay. It's your Bible. It's not sacrilegious to write in your Bible or to mark in them and, and do all kinds of stuff. So we want to encourage you to read. And if you have questions, um, certainly moms and dads and, and your family are available for you. But as your pastor... Uh, myself and Pastor Rebecca, we're here to help answer questions and guide you. Um, both Debbie and Victoria would do that, and the larger body of Christ. How many of y'all, choir and larger church, if one of these young'uns had a question about the Bible, would you be willing to help them answer it? Okay, you see those people. So y'all pray with me. Say, Dear God, thanks for the Bible. Thank you for speaking through the Bible. Thank you for the blessings of the past thousands of years and the blessings you've brought through your word to your people. We give you thanks that we're part of that people, that you bring blessings to through the Bible. Open us, challenge us, excite us, and bless us that we can be a blessing for you. We ask it in Jesus' name and all God's people said, amen. All right, thank you all, Miss Carolyn. Bring it to Sunday school all the time. Miss Carolyn has uh, Bible pops, Bible pops.